incredibly hot overall. We are lacking the heat here on Earth, at least in our area, <laughs> as we go through the day today. A cold finish to the weekend. We'll be tracking rain, snow, probably more snow for some overnight into tomorrow morning. It's going to be a sloppy start to the week, and then we're back into the 50s before you know it. So 21 degrees and clear right now in Ann Arbor, also downtown. It's 18 degrees in Pontiac, Mount Clemens, and Port Huron. Those are the air temperatures, even with a light wind, even a calm wind to the north, of course, will help out. But even a light wind helps out just a little bit. Feels like 15 right now in Ann Arbor. Also, Detroit feels like 14 degrees in Windsor. So once again, our temperatures are going to be feeling colder just because that wind chill will stay remaining in the upper 20s to low 30s through the afternoon, even with a light east wind. So temperatures will be cold. Notice how our sun begins to fade. High clouds by 9 a.m. By noon, we're looking at more and more cloud cover. Certainly by the afternoon, the evening brings an overcast sky again near 40 degrees. Once we get past 8 o'clock tonight, we start to increase our chances for snow, especially south of the city. And this is the reason. This is a system we're watching through the central plains right now. So as we time things out, we're going to first notice the clouds coming up from the south. This is 530. So that again represents that timeline I showed you with the temperatures at near 40 degrees by then. And then 8 o'clock from Jackson to Adrian. So starting south of I-94, the snow starts. It begins to lift northward. By 9 o'clock from Jackson to Ann Arbor should be making it into the city by that point and then widespread snow between 10 and 11 o'clock. We will see it become more scattered at times through the overnight, even mixing with some rain on the far east side. Whenever we get rain mixed in, of course, it's going to cut down on snow amounts, but the longer it stays as snow back to the west and north, the better chance to see over an inch of snow. So when we look at the accumulation and keep in mind too, this is out before noon tomorrow. So the afternoon tomorrow will rebound and then everything Thing just sort of melts, but one to two inches across the area, lesser amounts where you're seeing a bit of a mix on the east side and with it sticking to grassy surfaces, car tops, things like that, the roads should mainly be wet or occasionally slushy with some of those higher totals exceeding an inch, especially again to the west and north. So brightest early today, more clouds as the afternoon wears on. We'll hold off on the snow chances until this evening or tonight after 8 p.m. Temperatures down near the freezing mark, 49 degrees tomorrow. So you can imagine it's going to melt. And then upper 40s on Tuesday, we are back into the 50s by midweek.